Big thanks to Steve and Donna for having me back again. Very excited to be here. Good to see all these old friends, make some new friends, and talk about music for the whole week. And so I'm going to start off with kind of a... Well, it's, it's since Valentine's just a, hey, Valentine's Day just happened a few months ago. I'll uh, do a Valentine's Day song about love. Well, you jump out of bed, and I'm a sleepy head, you put wood in the stove, and I'm still dozing, you're feeding the dogs, I'm a bump on a log. You got to be my Valentine. Well, you're making breakfast, and I'm in the shower, baking the eggs. Whoa, take a nap, hold on the bottle, there's no hard water. You got to be my Valentine. You got the sweetest smile that I have ever seen. Oh. You got those big old brown eyes. You got red roses in your cheeks. Oh my! You got to be my Valentine. that I took from uh, 
You guys know Harry Nilsson? Some people say he was the, a lot of people think they're the fifth Beatle, but I think he was really the fifth Beatle. So this kind of counts as the Beatles too. I'm going to do a little Beatles medley coming up. And uh, Harry Nilsson is, uh, he's great. And he's got this album called The Point. If you haven't checked it out, check it out. It's really great. So there's a song, it's kind of like this, I don't know, it's kind of a musical and lyrical fractal that comes back on itself. It's really fun. So anyways, think about your troubles. Oh, and this song I'm going to utilize a special rhythm that I devised. It's called the, the Skewton Beat. And this is the, the song, this is a beat that we use with this band a lot. Um, and it's kind of like this. Sit beside the breakfast table, think about your troubles. Pour yourself a cup of tea and think about the bubbles. You can take your teardrops, drop them in a teacup, take them down to the riverside, then throw them over the side to be swept up by a current, then take it to the ocean to be eaten by some fishes, who were eaten by some fishes and swallowed by a whale who grew so old. Decomposed. <laughs> well, he died and left his body to the bottom of the ocean. And everybody knows that when a body decomposes, all the basic elements are given back to the ocean. And the sea does what it ought to. And soon the salty water and it's not for drinking Cause you taste just like it And so you run into a filter And it comes out from the faucet And pours into a teapot Which is just about to bubble Everybody think about your troubles <laughs> See, now we're going to do a Beatles song. 
<laughs> and I, 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 this, it's funny because I was talking with Biscuit the other day, and he, he's like, yeah, man, I'm going to do my contest version of, of Eleanor Rigby. I was like, oh, you are? Funny, because I have a contest version of Eleanor Rigby, too. <laughs> and so, so that's, I, wanted to show, I wanted to show him my contest version. Is Biscuit around? You, you want to come check this out? Oh, come on, man, you can even see it. Thank you. 